Dervinia stood beside a road and noted how many people were in each car as it passed. Here were her results. So we have the number of people in a car, and we're going from one person, two people, three people, four people, five people, and the number of cars. For example, there were 51 cars that had three people in it. Estimate the probability that the next car to pass has one person in it. So from this table, we can actually estimate probabilities. This is called what using relative frequency. So reproduce the table in columns. So we've got the number of people in car and the number of cars. The number of cars is actually called frequency. What we need to do is to add up the total number of frequencies so we know the total number of cars. So that adds up to 250 when we add these numbers together. Then an estimate of the probability can be obtained from the relative frequency. So we want the probability of one person, so there's 62 out of a total of 250. So, all right, and as a fraction, that comes down to 0 0.248. The probability of four people in the car, that's going to be 27, divided by 250, which, which is equal to 0 0.108.